What's good everyone, it's MJO23Dan, back with another video. Today's video is going to be about the Air Jordan 23 shoe tree. Now, why the shoe tree? So, I recently acquired the Air Jordan 23 trophy room and figured, man, they're really missing a final touch to the shoes, and that being the shoe trees. So, in 2008, Jordan Brand decided to release a premier Air Jordan 23 and a finale Air Jordan 23 both of which had hang tags. One was numbered on my finale. This one was out of 529. I have 106 out of 529. And then they had 529 for the United States and 529 for the world in the premiere, 1,058 pairs. Since the numbers in the US were numbered, the ones internationally were not. So this happens to be an unnumbered pair. But anyways, besides all that, these came with cedar shoe trees. And what made these special is that it has the Nike or the Jordan brand logo right up in there. So I figured, why aren't these in the trophy rooms? So what I have for you today are two packages. And I figured, man, why not? Deserves it, right? The Air Jordan 23 that released at Trophy Room are special pairs. And they deserve special treatment. So, what I decided to do was look up Cedar Shoe Trees and I found a company called Song Mics. Alright, and I found this on uh, eBay. And, you know, I was checking Amazon too to see if the prices were a lot better, but eBay was the place to go. And I wanted to find it similar to this right here. Now, I'll leave this right here just to see. It's both the same packages, so we'll just open one up. And I try to match it as close as possible. But the difference here is that one's gold and one is silver. So it's not really going to be exactly as is but I really just wanted to get something similar so I guess you can call this gold plated this actually you can remove and this one you can as well so these are just hardware pieces that you can find on like hardware stores like Lowe's or something like that Home Depot and they just screw on to the shoe tree so if I really wanted to, to match it up, I could probably remove this one and find something similar at those hardware stores and just replace it and then probably spray paint this or I don't know, something. Uh, this is like a, a plated type thing, but it basically does the same thing as this one. So um, all the other ones I found, they were like three piece at the four foot. And then there was like splits here at the end, but um, you know, I really wanted something that looked a little bit similar to the original. Now, another difference is of course, the branding. So you have the branding of the Jumpman right up in there. If anybody, anybody, any of my subscribers or followers on social media uh, do this type of work, let me know and um, maybe we can work something out. But it'd be really cool to have like a branding uh, right on there on the counter piece. So this is one piece. This fits 10 to 11 and there's different sizes. And let's go ahead and put the shoe up here. Now the trophy room, the white one and the black one only came in the cardboard. So I'll go ahead and pull out both cardboard pieces and then just go ahead and fit these right in. So uh, they're not adjustable at all. It's spring loaded. So you can see that it, once you fit it right in, it's going to adapt to the shoe. So throw this right in, spring loaded again. And this is gonna keep the shape of the shoe over time. So it doesn't crease and that's what it looks like in one. Go ahead and put it in the other. 
Again, these are a size uh, size 10, and my black trophy rooms are a size 10 and a half, so I did go t size 10 to 11. That's gonna be a perfect fit. So anyways, these are like one of the things that are really missing when it comes to premium shoes. So uh, I think it looks pretty dope. So, uh, and you know what? I think the gold really sets it off and it kind of uh, somewhat matches the shoe overall. So uh, I think maybe I'll just leave it as is. So, and then I have my titanium 23 and you have, you know, the nice silver to gold contrast right there. Anyways, like I said, if, if anybody does that John Man branding, uh, let's let's communicate and work something out. You can go ahead and contact me, email, social media, whatever you need to do. But uh, I think it'd be pretty dope if I just had that branding on there and uh, you know kind of match you know the rest of the shoes. So if you guys like this product, I'll go ahead and link like one of the eBay auctions in the description. I believe they're about like between 19 and 25 dollars. So uh, again, this is a great like little tool or little tip that you can do with you know keeping your shoes in its correct position and just a little nice touch to the shoes uh, if you guys like the content subscribe to the channel give me a thumbs up and i'll talk to you guys later take care